three, two, one. All right, week one of season 14, Miners. We've got some Volume Pirates versus the Republicans. First grab goes to PK Smurf Ball. Not sure if that's actually PK, probably not. <laughs> PK Smurfle gets out the bottom, uh, but Elden and Evan can't keep the flagging base long enough. PK is trying to stay alive while Fruitsy tries to escape. It's a close one there. Indian gets the re, gets out. They got anti set up in the blue base, but he can't hit the boost. First power up round goes in the favorite to the, the blue team, which is, uh, who is that? That would be the Republicans, I believe. Some volume pirates are the first to get on the board. 1 0 cap and game 1 half 1. And Egan gets a nice grab with his own button. But Fruitsy's in the way for this lineup perfectly for the boost. Nice round of power ups come up. A uh, couple of spikes in mid, trying to get that mid pop. PK Smurf Ball coming in with the rolling. But there's two tab rows to meet him. PK used his rolling to stay alive, gets out. Tag probes are finally running out. No caps as a result of the power ups this round. Fruitsy gets out, pass three, just needs a return for a cap, Obama swipes hard, Indian escapes with enough time for Elden to get the re-grab. Fruitsy's still trying to keep things alive, trying to get a cap here, he's got 2v2 blocks in base, just needs to get around, trying to make something happen, he's got boost coming up, he can use the boost, try to get into the wall, misses that, probably gonna try to go for mid-pup, rolling, too late. Still 2v2 in base for him, bombs right into his blocker. Infinite Sky with a nice move to get into the gate there. But Fruitsy a little too slow to get the return. Oh, there's almost a cap of PKs there for the re. And it could be a counter cap, but Obama moves up perfectly into OD positioning.
Nice round of power-ups coming up. Evan gets a tag pro. Mid escapes with the rolling bomb. Looks like Frederick Juice, sorry. Indian's coming in for a cap. Oh, he somehow gets it in before Infinite Sky can get to re-grab there. Even with three blue players in base. Wow. Oh, those rolling bombs about to expire. She tries to use it. It runs out. She can't use it anymore. Portals aren't there to save her. Infinite Skies escapes in the in the traffic there. PK with a kiss. Can I get Elden play the anti? She can't get the snipe. Flag gets out of base yet again. It was a nice boost through gate. It was close, but Blue Team was able to get the button there. Elden gets a nice handoff. No bomb yet for her to work with. Five seconds too early. Good positioning there by Elden to get that true juice mid. Oh, it was nice to beat them to that boost there. Because Infant Sky had gate there. Would have been a cap possibly. Oh, then needs to stay alive for a second. There it is. Tie pros out. And blue team's able to get to base and return their flag. Finally get both teams reset here after a long ordeal with both flags being out for a while. But the power-ups are about to throw that uh, for a curveball. Some team probably get out here. There we go. Elden ignores the power-up, tries to get a grab. Doesn't work out for her. Final minute of play. Got some tag pros to work with. Oh wow! Just barely gets the kiss before the button comes in. The last few grabs coming in here. So far, it's been a tie game, very close game. Three, two, one. And the first half ends in a tie, 1-1. No kept flags.
The Republicans, though, killing it on power ups, 18 to 9. Alright, we're about to start the second half of game one here in just a second. Looks like uh, some volume parts needed a few minutes to talk over their strategy so they can avoid the overtime here. Definitely do not sign up for that for the streaming. Hopefully this gets done within an hour. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, and game's launch. You're about to start here. Game one, half two. It's all tied up. One one in the first half. Pretty two. slow game. Good yeah. control by each team. Uh, in terms of handling the flag, although they let it out of base quite a bit. See if both defenses can lock it down here. Give their team an advantage, hopefully. So far it's going just as in the first half, pretty slow game, trying to use those power-ups to their advantage here. Looks like the tag pros could be the most useful here. Mr. Fruitsy clearing out the red base, trying to get a chain going here for some volume pirates. He's got two to beat, but that juke juice on Indian slowing him down. Fruitsy clears off two, clears three, just PK, anti-re on the ball there, the bomb. Infinite Sky breaks the tie, 2-1, some volume pirates. Fruitsy out here through the gate. No one's close to the flag for Republicans. It's an easy cap for him. Infinite Sky trying to delay so Fruitsy can grab power ups, but looks like the cap or the uh, regrab chain's been broken. But Fruitsy luckily peels off to get a tag pro just in time. He gets two boosts in his favor, gets the team boost, but can't do much with it. <laughs> Infinite Sky gets around the corner past Evan, but Indian gets out. Fruitsy trying to hold down base with a tag pro. Could bomb straight down, and this is the bomb. Both teams not really having much luck besides when they use the bombs and power ups, so it goes on Transilio. Republicans get in position to win all three that round. Can they make use of it? They had a rolling on defense trying to get Fruits here and Infinite Sky way out of position as the Tiger Pro lead comes in. Smurfball hits off the wall, it's gonna cost them a cap. Smurfball just needed to stay in front straighter line. Oh wow, a good boost block there by Evan. Almost leads to a cap, and this guy just barely sneaks by with a grab. Indian's still trying to work it. Evan with the block. Herbie gets tempted towards the Juke Juice. Indian goes around the world in caps.
All right, halfway through game one, half two. With five minutes to go. Republicans down one cap. <laughs> Indian grabs, but mistimes the power up in the grab there. Could have worked out for him. He could have had a rolling. Either way, Republicans ends up with uh, two of the three power ups. Herb uses his rolling against the tag pro, trying to stay alive. Bay trying to get out through the portal. Evan does a good job containing him there. Indian bombs through gate, no one's fast enough towards the button. Let's get a tie it back up. Tie game 3-3. Three, three. Republicans offense sacrifices the rolling bomb again, trying to get the two flaccid crabs. But again, Republicans get a tag pro, holding down in base. I think it's Ellen's second or third this game. She misses the snipe though on Obama. Evan needs to contain for a while here. Don't don't let him get to the bomb. The bomb is out bottom. Ellen's playing an anti. Tag pro's out though. Evan misses the bomb, but he gets the rebound return. And Ellen is able to keep up the anti. Indian's got gate open for PK here. Goes around the top of the gate instead. He's got the boost lined up, just waiting for the... Oh, he goes bottom instead. Might have some timers on this bomb, maybe. It's too late for him, though. Some volume Pirates wins their base again this time. Tag Pro goes in their favor. They're going to be able to lock down base here as Prusy gets out past two. He's got Gate. Doesn't go Gate because of Evan there. Straight down Bomb. Gets it in there for a one cap lead. Yeah. Bomb are bringing it back quick. Tag Pro's out though, so he's got three to work against. Some volley pirates get win their base again here, doing a good job containing or uh, capturing that power up throughout the game. Looks like they're all rolling bombs this time. Herb is the only one intact, uses it for a slight bump on defense. But Anti Ray comes through, almost gets a bomb out. That would have been a nice combo. Sixty seconds remaining. Republicans are gonna to need to start thinking about playing anti right here so they can get their base locked down, give their offense a chance to cap. And they get the full reset here, but power up responding, hopefully it doesn't catch them out of position. Big battle here in the the base, bottom base, but just the rolling. Alden's got a juke juice on re able to lock it down. The tag pro spawns in mid, no one's there to grab it right away. And it goes towards the Symbolian Pirates. They're able to use that possibly on defense here. Lock down the base. Infinite Sky thinks about it. I guess it gets called to O. They are up one. Hopefully they know that. Don't need to grab here. Just play some good OD. Possibly the last chance for the Indian to get a cap here. Trying to work his way around. He's got the bomb and the boost. Alright, he can't fill it. Uh, here comes Anti-Re though. Coming off the bottom. 
he rushed the boost. I mean, he gets a nice block on Fruitsy, but gets pushed into the corner. And Indian is not going to be able to get towards the base in time. Some ball hit players are going to take game one, four to three. Close game. Looks like some of the team members are taking a quick bathroom break here. Should be back shortly. Alright, game's launched. We're about to be in. So we do have a substitution here for the uh, Republicans. Tyrant comes in for Infinite Sky.
I think Messi's a sub too, I forgot who he replaces, but Messi's sub works out for some balling pirates that he gets the cap. First cap of the game, 1-0. Tyrant looking to counter cap here off the top wall. Trying to go under now, staying alive. PK sub off. <laughs> Good, just walks in, he hesitated there for a second. Almost cost him the cap, but distracted by power ups, he's able to sneak past the blue defenders. And Elvin gets a nice boost around the corner, the classic Jardine boost into the corner with the team boost. Unlike Transilio, Jardim is known for its high scoring games. Ready up two, two points to one here in uh, game two, half one, only two minutes in. Fruity hiding on the bottom there. Power ups are spawning soon. Fruitsu avoided OD to get a Tag Pro. He's able to catch up in time, it looks like, but Elden has a Tag Pro of her own. Good job by Fruitsu staying alive here and not kissing the Tag Pro right away, because that would have put him all the way back towards his base. Kisses the Tag Pro now, but that's alright, they both should be out. PK stuck on the right side. Herb does a good job containing as Fruitsy pushes up from below. Fruitsy chasing after, trying to get the bomb snipe here. Misses it, but gets the boost combo right back at him. Fruitsy tries to push him right, doesn't take the bait. Going up red towards Herb and Lionel Messi. Some ball pirates need to start playing anti here. And this re grab chain they haven't gotten out in a while of their own. Tyrant almost has a straight line cap, but he goes off the top wall instead. Misses his chance. PK takes the top route. Again, top corner. Gives the cap. Tyrant doing a lot of work there in the blue base. Antiri finally gets out of base with the flag. But Fruitsy has his own plans with the, the red flag here. Trying to juke around. Trying to go down the right side, but Tyrant's there. Taking out his boost. Fruitsy gets stuck. Tyrant can't curl it in yet. Have to take a lap. Pirates battle start here. Tyrant's gonna be able to snag the one on the bottom, looks like. But he gives up the position to Herb. Herb gets the tag pro. See if the uh, some volume pirates can make use of it, but he grabs possibly accidentally here. And Ellen's already got the anti reset up, so it's gonna be a waste of a tag pro. Publicans finally wins both power ups. They got Tag Pro, Drew Juice to work with. I've been staying alive. Ellen trying to go for a turn. I got him cornered here. Messi somehow escapes. It's back into the death corner again. This time he gets returned. But Ellen's Tag Pro wasted most of that time just going for the return, but able to use just the nice boost block to clear out the path for Tyrant to get a cap. 
so far it's looking like the uh, decision to swap in Tyrant has worked out well for the Republicans here in game two. An anti-re, it's a nice quick cap. Basically just a Hail Mary shot into the base there, hopefully not touching blue and he gets the cap. So Ball and Pirates need to do a better job of not letting the red flag carrier take that team boost in the top right corner to keep positioning themselves behind the boost, but that's just leaving just too much space for the flag carrier to take the boost whichever direction they want. Oh, that was a nice try off the corner there. You can tell it was planned. Red Fruitsy read it. Tyrant out again. He's got the team boost to work with, but Obama cuts him off. It's a bloodbath on the left power up there as three players get spiked, two of them due to the first boost. Alden ends up with the rolling bomb. Doesn't have the bomb yet to work with, has to take the grab with the rolling bomb. Comes up, it's so a 2v2. Herb's quick on her tail, and she can't get the cap. But here comes PK Smurf Ball. Obama's out though, pass three, returns a cap for blue team here. <laughs> and there it is, the team boost cost. Uh, PK Smurf Ball there as he boosts right into one of the blue team. Looks like some Balling Pirates have finally got a re-grab train, go re train going here. You know Messi goes uh, left there but Evan's there to cut off the team boost before. Power-ups are about to spawn, anti re grabs are rolling, Fruitsy has a rolling re, Obama takes a nice kiss there to get Fruitsy the rolling grab while PK is defused. Fruitsy brings it all the way back towards the red base. He had tried to take his, push his luck down the red tiles, but Obama's there to block anti re prevent the momentum from catching up to Fruitsy. They kiss, but it looks like Republicans were in a better position for that kiss there as Alden was on anti. Final minute here, final round of power ups. 5 2 so far in game 2, half 1. Messi's outright, they got a tag pro to support, just needs to clear up base now, hopefully this return comes soon, Tyrant trying to stay alive, the boost by Alden to get the forced kiss there works out well, because that tag pro on defense on Herb there was pretty threatening. Last chance for grabs here by both teams. One more bomb coming up for Fruitsy. Tries to use it, might get out. Not in time though. Game two, half one ends, 5-2 in the favor of Republicans. The Tyrant coming in strong, gets the cap uh, on the sub there, so that's good for them. Smurfball leading though with three caps.
Symbolium Pirates is taking the full time out here to go over strategies. Chem trying to get the final words of encouragement in here. Alright, they're launching the game. Should be started up here in 15 seconds. Alright, game two, half two started here. Quick grabs here by the Republicans, even though they have a strong lead of 5 2. Republicans starting off strong with the regrab train here. I don't think uh, Symbolian Pirates have gotten out yet. Fruitsy playing anti re I know he doesn't like playing defense. Able to hold on the forward till Obama gets back for him. Fruitsy finally free to go, but he was able to stop the regrab chain. Guess there is some defense in him. Now. First round of power-ups coming up. Big battles on each side. No one dies though. Ends up with two juice juices for some ball and pirates. Despite the two juice juices, ball and pirates can't get out yet. They have three caps they need to make up here. Two v two in base for the tyrant. It's probably gonna go high. Gets cut off in time by Obama. And Fruity looks like there was some good anti there by Lionel to uh, block out Evan. Fruity gets a straight team boost in for a cap, closing the gap to only two caps. Fruity trying for his second cap in a row here. Off two for two. No. Alvin gets out with the help of that bomb blast. Tricky situation there for Republicans. Can't quite catch up. <laughs> Some volume pirates have brought it into the one cap game. And Fruity ties it up. We have a tie game 5-5 five, five, with just under three minutes played in game two, half two. Starting to wonder if there's some red bias on this map or Gem's uh, extra coaching in halftime paid off. Fruitsy with a nice boost grab there. Tyrant getting blocked out hard, 2v1. Fruitsy walks in for the go ahead cap for some volume pirates here. Fruitsy going back for another grab, almost had the boost lined up again. Republicans definitely seem caught off guard here by the fast start by some ball and pirates get four caps in four minutes. Some ball and pirates killing it on the power game this uh, half. They got the majority so far, I believe. A tyrant's got a tag pro, trying to even things out here. Probably get a tag pro lead going. Gets the nice snipe down the spikes. Gets another snipe with an X boost. Just got to clear up fruits here, line on one of them. Anti re. He's get around, tries to get a block, 
doesn't go the right correct direction, gets returned by Lionel Messi. Evan has the team boost to work with, but Lionel's lined up in the right spot to delay him. Some volume parts gets a reset with Fruitsy playing defense again. Fruitsy setting up the blocks for Obama. Man, Fruitsy doing the two-way ball this half. Some Bollywood Pirates have come back strong to start this first half of this second half of game two. Have a two-cap advantage right now. Fruitsy coming in, 1v1 blocks. Can't get the bomb straight up in time. Tab Pro is coming in. Could be trouble here. Oh, but Herb gets his night before Evan can spawn. No Obama is a return for a cap, but they go for the kiss. Alright, both teams are reset, see who can hold it longer. And it looks like some all parents are the first to give up the re-grab chain. Republicans trying to time out the power-ups, it looks like. The tyrant trying to take advantage of the Power ups, Fruitsy grabs the tag bro though, so he's gonna have to wait out. Fruitsy playing OD with the tag bro, hopefully he doesn't get pushed out of the way. Probably see some sac sacrifice here, but no. He gets a push, tries to get to grab, gets the kiss. Tyrant, pass two here. No boost to work with quite yet. Final gets the OD return. It's a tough bomb there, you definitely don't want to hit the bomb to give the flag here more distance between the chasers and it ends up hurting the republicans there so volume pirates get a 3 cap lead now could be a 4 cap lead for the boost backwards instead of boosting across had just too much downward momentum off the wall Obama getting juked out of his shoes man Ellen showing off her stuff Looks like Republicans have returned to getting their power-ups. Nothing much happening for them though on offense this game. It's a good combo to boost there, but some bombing pirates were expecting it had four players on OD, so not quite the time to push it. But Tyrant sneaks in a cap here between two or three OD defenders. Looks like the bomb knocks some players out of position there. So it's a two cap game. Currently six to eight in favor of the Symbolian Pirates. And Lionel gives the handoff to Fruitsy. Fruitsy doesn't make the corner, but is able to bait uh, Elden into a spike. Power ups are spawning soon. See if they can use any of them. It's like juke juice for either team. Fruzzi tries for the bomb for the anti re. Misses it. They go for the kiss. Republicans trying to even things back out. Make it a closer game. We got two caps to make up in 90 seconds. They had the re gap chain there for a second, but Urban Fruzzi lock it down again. Fruzzi playing defense. Get stuck over there in that half of the map again. Now he's free to move to offense. But definitely has a stronger game on defense this season than in the past, what I've seen. Ooh, Evan almost gets juked around the spike, is able to get back around, get the help, the boost. One more minute, last round of power-ups. Messi steals the tag pro and Republicans also get their own tag pro. See if Evan can get out. Tyrant needed to stay alive there. She shouldn't really have taken the kiss. 
Not one of them stay back here to tag pro player anti here. Yes, there it is. Misses the sniper that on herb there. Fruity trying to come in, trying to delay time. We got 20 seconds to make up a cap. Make up two caps, sorry. The first half was five to two. Fruity. Alright. Looks like some volume pirates are gonna get a comeback win on Jardim. Whatever Gem said at halftime half definitely worked out. Spruzzi gets four caps. And Power of Battle is tied that half.